so after Mark hit the deer, I mean, we hit the deer and Mark quit. Like I said, that was like early October. We did, we did a couple, uh, some more, another little tour with no bass. I mean, with no banjo. Yeah, with no banjo. And uh, played Baltimore. And uh, then played Pumpkin Town Mountain Offery at the Carl Story Theater, at the Carl Story Festival. It was my birthday, 1991. And this bald headed dude with like this biker, like, which road are you gonna choose? It said, or something like that. And we thought well, that guy's a Christian biker, you know, because he had that shaved head and, and, and uh, Brute Bernard. And uh, he, he played the banjo and, and he played, and that was Carl Yother, Uncle Carl. I'm like, oh my Lord. Man, we got, you know, hearing that a real bluegrass. Hey man, you want to play? You want to you want to be in the Drovers? And we we thought if we get three gigs out of him, that'd be cool, man. Mm -hmm. And he stayed with me for how long? God, twenty years or so, and uh, or more since '91 to, to that's right, yeah. last year. That's I was wanting to go rip full bluegrass, you know, but we were all rock people learning to play that music, and uh, you know we up for. New Grass Revival, Scott's like, how long you been playing mandolin? And Sam Bush, like, at that time in 1988, he said, oh, about 26 years? How long you been playing? Oh, since April? <laughs> yeah, we were all right. And man, I, I would see these bands right here on this stage, I, I wanna be better than them. Mm -hmm. I wanna be like them, but I wanna be better than them. I, we're doing our own songs. I remember one time, I can't remember, you know, it's funny, Lindsey said he, I don't remember him playing. I remember meeting him out here in the, in the camping ground, uh, you know, drinking beer out in the open, laughing, being alive at a party, and I, dang, that guy's cool, man, me and Rob, that guy's super cool. But I forgot, I don't know who, what band it was, they did that, uh, Woe Mule, where, you, where you, all you're doing is scraping your picks behind the bridge, and, he, and then going, you know, I can't even do it with the thing, you know, I'm doing, and, uh, it was like seeing Jimi Hendrix for the first time. I'm like, oh my God. I was so depressed. We suck compared to them. We are so rinky dink amateur. Oh my God. And but we finally got it. 